Just got a check. Just flipped it on a home for a jet. Just got a new five more. Just cut a check. And all of my commas, they disrespect. And Hello, and welcome back to another vlog. Vlog. Today is Friday. Uh, I don't know why that sounded so sad, but I'm so happy that today is Friday. Today is Parent Teacher Conference Day. Decided to dress up just a little bit so I look a little presentable this week. Has been one of those weeks where everything is happening at one time. And it's like, what? And I have a couple of conferences that I need to do. So that is why I am here and I also wanted to work in my classroom because we are coming back to in-person learning really, really soon. So that's going to be happening in a couple weeks. I've been doing my in-person after school tutoring. So I've been like testing out these plexi plastic borders uh, and it's going to be rough. <laughs> I noticed that some of my students can't can't see because it's like a glare so they can't see my Promethean board so I think I'm gonna have to really really take advantage of my whiteboards and I'm gonna have to get all this clutter off my whiteboards like this handy dandy blue chart magnetic chart that's up there and then the how are we learning chart I don't know if I want to keep that up there because I'm gonna need both of my whiteboards I was looking at the other teachers classrooms and they have whiteboards on the right side of their wall and whiteboards on the left side of their wall and I'm like okay me and my two whiteboards are just gonna have to get along so that's all I have and my Promethean board sits smack dab in the middle of these whiteboards so I'm going to have to move my Promethean board and I don't know where I'm going to move it to. I know that it should not be moved to that window, but I also can't move the desk that I'm sitting at because it's like glued to the to the floor pretty much. <laughs> it's not glued to the floor, but it's heavy and also the cables and everything for this desktop are like specifically in this wall so I can't move this desk and the only other corner that that Promethean board can go to would be that window unless I move this but that's gonna be weird I just don't know how I'm going to fit all of my desks I, and I know the crazy thing is I know that I'm not going to have that many students coming to in-person learning. So it's like I feel like my setup right now is more realistic for how many students I'm going to have. So I have leftover desk. Like I just know that I'm not going to have that many students for in-person learning. So I'm just trying to think. That's why I'm here today too. And I need to get my walls together because I am indecisive and I'm like, oh, I like the math wall. I don't like the math wall. I like it today, but I might not like it tomorrow. I just want to make the room very presentable for my students. And I have so many things that I need to clean up because they've just been sitting there. So that's what we're doing today. This was gonna be a whole week vlog, but things were changing every minute of every day. And this week was just really, really one of those weeks where you keep getting different information about school reopenings and you're like, okay, okay, let me write that down. Oh, okay, it's changing, it's changing now. Let me, let me cross that out and write down the new stuff. So that's how my week has been going. And progress reports were due this week. So I've been doing everything and I've been staying later than I should be trying to get everything out of the way. Um, my parent conferences are going really, really beautifully though. I'm getting the hang of this parent conference situation. I like it. So I'm trying to stay on top of everything. And that last vlog, I was doing more engaging, engaging activities for student engagement. So I found out that when we reopen, we have to use as little technology as possible. 
So I gotta figure that out too now. I'm gonna have to print up a whole bunch of stuff and get my uh, activities and lesson plans going so that it correlates with pencil and paper. They're not gonna be used to that because they've spent a whole year and a half doing online learning. But remember, in that last packet that I gave them, I gave them lots of paper pencil activities that we've been doing. So it's like I'm easing them into the foundation of what we're gonna be doing when we come back. So they'll be ready. They'll definitely be ready. And then my in-person tutoring is helping me decide a lot of factors in the classroom as well. So I know what's working for them and what's not going to work for them at all. So that's what I've been doing. <laughs> that's why I'm vlogging on a Friday now that I've had a minute to, to breathe because it's the first day I'm not teaching. It's a student free day and I am just doing my parent conferences. I have another conference coming up in a few minutes. I just wanted to get on and explain what happened this week. So I'm gonna have to change a lot of things around the class. I definitely wanna decorate my cabinet. Look at my poor little St. Patrick's Day wreath <laughs> held up by masking tape because I can't find my regular clear tape. It would look so much better with clear tape, but St. St. Patrick's Day is over. I need to fix that. I wanna decorate that cabinet into something cool. And I also want to do something with these cabinets as well. I just don't know what I'm doing with these. Today is my day of like outlining the blueprint of what my room is going to look like. Because I feel like when I came in here in the summertime, I didn't really have a clue. And I just like put stuff on the walls because I'm like, they're coming back eventually. And I'm happy I didn't take everything down because they are coming back. So I don't have a lot to do. I just want to switch some things. I still have my light bulb sticker, believe it or not. It's lasted. I love wall stickers, but I'm not going to be tacky and put a whole bunch of wall stickers. I'm just going to keep that one. The desk only have to be four feet apart, and I feel like they are four, four feet apart. This is not my final layout at all in any way whatsoever. I just want to get an idea of how this is going to look. I have a kind of a mess over here. I'm still getting these walls together again. I've thrown away a box and a couple of other trash items. And I still want to get this wall together. And then my classroom plexiglass desk are positioned correctly. Um, I'm just trying to get the layout, like the feel for everything. This is where my Promethean board sits, and I have like this row and I have that row of dust. And you see the whiteboard behind it, it's kind of in an awkward position. I use both whiteboards, but then the Promethean board kind of covers it up just a little bit. And then I have that closet-like piece of furniture over there, and then I added this table to my room as well, so this is going to be like my kidney table, but it's not a round table, it's a square table, but I'm still going to use it. And so I'm still trying to figure out, do I want this to stay because I really want to use it next year in my class for next year. I really, really do. I don't want to get rid of it. And then I also want to move this table right here because I'm not going to be using this. I'm probably going to put this table outside. And then I still have to figure out where these desks are going. I'm not going to have that many students in my room, so I'm pretty sure I can get rid of these desks and put them somewhere else or have the custodian put it somewhere else. And then I want to get rid of this because I don't need this. I have my other one over there that was by the whiteboard. So I want to get rid of this. I think I'm going to put this outside today. And then this, these are going to go up against the wall. And I'm going to take these back to that teacher store. Not every one of my desks has the plexiglass yet. I'm still waiting for um, the rest of my plexi plastic glass to come in. But I want to get this laminated so I can use this for next year. And it'll be easy to just wipe it down with some sanitizing um, cleaning 
a cleaning agent and then use it again next year. That's kind of where I'm at right now with everything. It's like I, I started to kind of take that down one day when I was like, I don't think we're coming back, but I think I can put that back up now because I was tripping just a little bit, ignore that. Today was kind of a short vlog because so much is happening and everything changes by the hour. I still don't know if I'll be teaching my students in person or if I'll be the online teacher for all the online students who are choosing, whose parents are choosing for them to stay online, so. I don't know, but as far as right now, like, my room will be set up. I really don't know what's going to happen. But I'm going to go because I am very, very hungry, and the day is done for me, and I still want to stay here. So I think I'm just going to get some food, eat, and then come back and figure out what I want to do with everything. But as far as the vlog goes, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end it right here. Yeah, I will see you in my next vlog. Bye. Fit, take a flick, see my fit, it's a fit, it's a fit. See my fit, it's a fit, yeah, I'm fit, take a flick. See